Welcome back to my channel, Tires Gamer. So this is um first of January, twenty fifty four. Wow, in Soccer Manager twenty twenty three. So um today I want to talk about the perfect transfer stack strategy if you want to build your team. Um, some of us will say this team is built already, so there is nothing more to build. But is that true? I still have um the stadium. I'm still building the stadium, and I don't have up to one billion yet. I think I had that in some of the teams that I managed. So I think I still need the transfer strategy um, to make my squad grow the same time I grow the team um, funds and the rest. So this is how I'm going to do it, how I always do it. Um, using the uh, free agents, this game has made it in a way that you can sign some of the best players, you can even sign them as free agents. Um, the Christian scene that I'm using right now as the top stri striker who was 99. Oh, sorry, who is 99 now? I bought him on a free transfer from Think Saint Etienne. Yeah, he wasn't being used much there, so I had to, to take that one up as a free transfer. Then started training him. So, um, for the transfer strategy, I would suggest that okay, if you are in a new team, you should first of all make sure that your training is up to the highest level. When you have the, your, your training facility to the highest level, then you can buy anybody. Um, for example, okay, let's get with those that are younger. There are many talents, young talents on the free transfer every season. So far, you have played up to two seasons upward in the game. You start to see um, great talents on as free agents. So, see here now, when you come here, you look for the young ones. Let's say if somebody is at the age of 16 and is worth up to 10 million. Okay, sorry, there is none of them at this time. Think this is because it's January transfer but if you see someone who is at the age of 16 17 and is worth up to 20 30 million then that means um you can make you can be sure that um the potential the person has the potential of up to 85 to yeah within the range of 85 to 97 is always um the case or most of the times though so you can sign up that one then train start training him play him a few matches throw him on some loans and um, he will be good in some years, either for you to sell him or to use him in your team. But now, um, let's let's remove the age. Let's look for other talents that we can get on free transfer. Anyways, you don't get much of the talents on January transfers. Sorry, you don't get much of the talents on January transfers because their teams won't allow them go. Um, it's always at the end of the year. But look at what we have here. We have someone at eight nine rating but i don't like the age the age doesn't help me so but we have this guy 26 i think he can still worth us some money i just have to pay him for a year then i can sell him off this is his valuation 20 million and when i play him in one or two matches he is surely going the valuation is surely going to increase then that's how we go about it we have one at 24 and he's an attacker this one still has some time to increase too, so I, I'm going to get this one. Then, okay, I think that's the, the youngest I can get here. So, um, let's check for the other ones that I bought some time ago that I'm not using in my team. I have some of the players. I know most of the players here, I bought them on free transfer. So, and it's time. This dude, I don't think I'm playing this dude. So that's it. That's how you are going to make the money. Um, when you've used them for about a year, then you can sell them and make back the money. Especially the ones you know you're not going to be using that much. This dude is unhappy. Let's place this one and transfer this. Same with this guy. And age is not even on their side. Okay, I think this guy has to go too. Wow, I have no other left back. These ones are already old. And they will be taking a lot of um what's it called? Um a lot of wages. So I think same with this guy. Then let's check the reserve team. Okay, this one I just got. I can place this one on loan same as this one that's what i'm telling you about this most of these players though some of them came from my own youth team i signed some of them too and i'll be giving them 
just a few years to be useful to the club so i sell them to make more money or some of them can fit into the squad but i i can see only a few fit into the squad here i don't i don't play players with potential that is lower than 91 or 90 so let's just say 90 so they have to start from potential 90, uh, potential 90 and above so this is it this is barely the transfer strategy i don't sign much on um, the transfer market or players that are still in their teams because that will cost me a lot so um that's the transfer strategy if you want to build your club follow this way and you are going to have millions or billions in your club as it may in just a few years give it um seven at max so that's it for today drop any questions you have in the comment section like the video subscribe if you haven't done so i'll see you guys in my next video Thanks.